Hi guys, welcome back to another video and today for something slightly different. I was just watching the new John Rogers video, by the way, great YouTuber, and I highly recommend you visit his channel. In his last video he visited the Maze Brook, in which he filmed the river beginning to end, however, he did miss a section, which I think is the best bit, so I'm about to include that in this video now. So John makes reference to Brook Court which you can see just here where my cursor is circling and he walks down beside the maze brook as far as a gate which is unopenable here and he comments on this area, the wetland area which is looked after by the environmental agency but the river continues and goes underneath the A13 and along the housing estate known as Thames Veer. Now today we're going to follow this as far as we can and see what we can see up as far as hopefully this area where John walked down Mover's Lane onto River Road to see the end of the Maze Brook here. So this is the shot of the A13, just over the bridge over the Maze Brook and over the railway as well. And it's from here we're going to be walking down the steps to our right hand side, down to the brook. As we make our way down the litter screen steps, we get our first glimpse at the Dagenham Dock railway line also with its brand new track for the Barking Riverside London Overground extension, which is in my other videos. It's quite a train spot of paradise this area really, as you can get right up close around the right hand side there are the steps to the locos themselves as they go past. But as we turn the corner, we can see the tunnel underneath the A13, which is quite futuristic, especially for the time that it was built, which was back in the early 2000s. And now we make our way through the futuristic design of this tunnel with all the flashing lights. You can just about see on the other end the bridge over the Maze Brook itself. This is a very popular route for walkers and cyclists from Thames View to Barking, and this is because it's the most direct link between the two. And here we are, this is our first view of the maze brook itself coming out from the other side of the A13. The maze brook itself now continues along the north side of the Thames View Estate, on the other side of the bridge here and we're going to try and follow it down now. At the end of the short walkway we can see a gate that's been left open and not locked with no padlock so we're going to make our way down here and see what we can see down this area. It seems the local children have been very busy down here They've got their own goal, some swings, a catch area, a trampoline and the old benches that we used to see in schools. I certainly remember these from when I was a child. The brook itself runs along behind this fence parallel to this field. Now I know John Roger and his watchers are quite partial to some interesting architecture and these apartment buildings are no exception having been built around 1955. This was what was back then to be seen as the future of housing and it's still standing strong today. Unfortunately there was a fence at the end of this field and we couldn't walk any further but I hope you found this video interesting. If you have do hit that subscribe button and the like. Take care and I'll see you next one. Goodbye.